Like many who dedicate their lives to cancer research, Dr. Morrison is motivated by a personal commitment to the cause. He began his career as a veterinarian, specializing in the treatment of horses, but decided to go to medical school after his sister passed away following a battle with cancer. She had asked him if he was happy with his life and told him to try to you know, achieve some happiness. And so he decided to go back to school and find a cure for cancer. Motivated by his own personal experience, Dr. Morrison has worked to develop a groundbreaking gene test, OmniSeq Target. The test allows physicians to make treatment recommendations based on patients' individual genetic makeup. Genes, which were once indecipherable, are now a tool in the fight against cancer. We are bringing genomics to the physician. We're taking genomics and we're demystifying it and bringing it to the physician so he can now use this state-of-the-art technology to treat his patients. That's a pretty big deal. The one-of-a-kind test will be able to help patients across the country, not just in western New York at Roswell Park. We're paving the way. You know, every day when we're working together, we come to realize that there's no good model for doing this out there. We're creating the model. Dr. Carl Morrison is the driving force behind that next major step forward in cancer care. Motivated by a personal commitment to the cause, the former veterinarian has reinvented himself to become a national leader in his field. Dr. Candace Johnson recruited Dr. Morrison, now the Director of Personalized Medicine, to come to Roswell Park Cancer Institute in 2007 and complete a critical project. Even then, he was a remarkable individual and showed um, a real passion for why we hired him, which was to develop a, a method for us to collect tissues from uh, surgery patients to be able to use those tissues in a translational way. A high-quality tissue bank is necessary for researchers who are studying tumors and cancer cells. If you're trying to um, discover the mysteries of cancer, how can we best treat it? How can we best detect it? How can we best prevent it? How can we best sort of figure out why this cancer grows the way it does? The best way is to take cancer cells from the patient, putting them in a bank so that investigators can use those tissues to answer their questions in their own research. Very important in a translational research. When Dr. Morrison came to Roswell Park, the tissue collection process was in need of structure and organization. He provided the necessary leadership and has created one of the best tissue banks in the country. I do not know any other example where this program will be so user-friendly, so comprehensive, and uh, I would say so accessible. It was something Carl had a vision for, and today we have one of the finest tissue collection operations in the country. Dr. Goodkoff, as well as other researchers, have come to Roswell Park because of Dr. Morrison's innovative approach. And I immediately recognized that we have a person who can make a difference in one of the most pivotal aspects of my research. And that obviously had a positive impact on our decision to come here. Dr. Morrison has made the time to achieve remarkable feats outside of work as well, including building his own home in Fredonia. We took at least seven to eight years now that he has built on to the old farmhouse, built this farm, redid the barns that were here, plus built some new ones. He did it all himself. Uh, there's very little outside help has came in. Dr. Morrison's life as a builder is just one part of his interesting backstory. Well, you may not know this about Carl, but he was actually a model at one time in Lexington, Kentucky. He was on, I think it was Farm Credit Bureau's billboard. As a builder, physician, veterinarian, father, and husband, Dr. Morrison has quite the varied background but he brings the same level of dedication to everything that he does. Everything Carl does is, is filled to the brim with passion. His motto is, never say can't. He says, that doesn't exist. And I believe it when you see him, when you see what he can do. I can see why he doesn't believe in the word can't. For his vision, passion, and leadership, we are pleased to recognize Dr. Carl Morrison with this year's Thomas B. Tomasi MD-PhD Hope Award.